hello you are welcome how to find the value of x in this nice algebra problem x raised to the power 3 plus x equals to 350 from here let's bring 350 to the left hand side and this become x cubed plus x minus 350 equals to 0 then from here we can separate this minus 350 as minus 3 43 then minus 7 so this becomes x cube plus x minus 3 43 minus 7 then equals to 0 then let's rearrange and we have x raised to power 3 minus 343 plus x minus 7 equals to 0 then we can rewrite 343 as 7 raised to power 3 so we have x raised to power 3 minus 7 raised to power 3 that's 7 times 7 times 7 we give us 343 and the plus x minus 7 equals to 0 then from this two terms from the identity a cube minus b cube here we can rewrite this as a minus b then into bracket a square plus a b plus b square and uh, this follow x square minus seven s cube minus seven cube so when we rewrite that this will be x minus seven then multiply by a square that's x square then plus a b that's plus x times seven that's seven x then plus b square that's 7 square and 7 square is 49 then we close bracket then plus x minus 7 equals to 0 so let's put x minus 7 in bracket as well now from here we have x minus 7 x minus 7 common let's take it out we have into bracket x minus 7 out then here remain x square plus 7x plus 49 then here remain 1 that's plus 1 after we have taken it out remain 1 here equals to 0 then from here in the next step we can add what we have here together and we have x minus 7 into bracket x square plus 7x plus 50 49 plus 1 50 equals to 0 so we have two possible cases here we have x minus 7 equals to 0 or we have x square plus 7x plus 50 equals to 0 and uh, from here we have a quadratic equation whereby a is equals to 1 b is equals to 7 and c equals to 50 so when we saw using quadratic formula and then uh, from here we have x we now be equals to minus b that's minus 7 plus or minus square root of b square 7 square minus 4 a c then all over 2 a that's 2 times 1 and then uh, in the next step we simplify and this is x equals to minus 7 plus or minus square root of 49 minus 200 when we multiply that then all over 2 then we have x to be equals to minus 7 plus or minus square root of 49 minus 200 will give us minus 151 then over 2 and we have minus square root of minus 1 here will be high so here we can say this is x equals to minus 7 plus or minus square root of 151 i then over 2 so here we have two other solutions then on this side we have a solution that is x equals to 7 so we say x1 equals to 7 then x2 equals to minus 7 plus root 151 r over 2 and the third solution x3 we have x3 equals to minus 7 minus root 151 i over 2 
and here we have these three values of x in this problem thank you for watching please share this video and subscribe to my channel also give it thumbs up see you next class and bye for now